I decided to do breast cancer research mainly because of my mum. So my mother first was diagnosed with breast cancer when I was 21 years old. One of the hard things about being a breast cancer researcher, I think for me, is the fact that um, I couldn't help my mum. So by the time I became a qualified breast cancer researcher and had an idea about what was going on within my mum's body with her breast cancer metastasis, so the time when the breast cancer is spread to all parts of your body, there was nothing I could do and nothing that science could do. And that was really hard knowing that. Um, I can remember having a conversation with my mum at the time, maybe three months before she died. Um, and we both sit there and sat there and cried and I'm like, I'm really sorry, I did this so I could help you, but I can't, you know, science can't help you at the moment and I'm really sorry. Unfortunately, it was too late for my mum and, and that was really hard. But I can save your sister, I can save your daughter or your grandmother. So with your support, I can t continue this research and make sure, hopefully, that we one day will live in a world free of breast cancer.